Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's Hobbyland here. We are doing a random pack break of 2016 Topps, Star, uh, Topps Chrome Star Wars The Force Awakens. This is break number uh, 20, break number 9. Where did I get 20? I'm not prepared, I need a knife. I don't know where all our knives go. There it is. This is break number 9 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. The next one is in the store right now, so check it out. Now what I'm going to do first is I'm going to number all of the packs. I'm going to number all of the packs and then we'll uh, randomize the names. Now, one spot for 10 bucks gets you two packs. So we'll double up that list too. All right, numbering first. All right, so that's one, which I'll set right over here. Now, if you're watching on YouTube, if you're watching the replay on YouTube, obviously you can fast forward through this boring part. Unless you like writing, you like to watch people write numbers on packs. Maybe you do. That's a th it could be a thing. And 24 right there. And now let me get everyone's names. Now Daniel Patera bought a boatload of spots in this. So he's going to have a majority of the packs. Let's go back to random.org. So there's everybody. So that's 12 names on the list, right? Daniel Patera with Last Bot Mojo as well. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. There we go. So we'll copy that list and double it up. So you, now you see Daniel Patera with the Last Bot Mojo star. You see it twice, you know, indicating that the list has been doubled up. Let's randomize that list. Six times, five and a one, six times. Two, three, four, five, and six. There you go. So as I said, Daniel has a majority of the packs. He bought 10 spots. So let me print out that list and that's your, so we'll do, we'll basically do all of, uh, we'll do, uh, actually, We'll do Nicholas and Justin's packs first, and then we'll open up the rest for Daniel. That'll be the easiest way to do it. Oh, here's my one of my favorite jingles on the TV back there, the Salino and Barnes jingle. All right, anyway, <laughs> 8.30 right there, Star Wars number nine. There's everybody right there. So we're gonna do Nicholas and Justin's packs first and then the rest will be for Daniel. That'll be the easiest way to go about it. All right, so Nicholas, you have packs four and 16. There's pack four. Nice, and that's a refractor. And pack 16. If you want to do more of this, folks, we don't have very many boxes left. $10 gets you two packs. That's it. It's not bad. And there's the refractor there. So there you go, Nicholas. All right, and next up, you know, we have two packs for Justin. You have pack seven and 18.
There's seven. And 18. Right there. Tommy Bowers asking if, uh, if, if I think Chelsea will get David Luiz back. Isn't the transfer window closed already? I thought it closed like an hour ago. All right. So those are the two packs there. So Daniel, it looks like you have the hit because you've got the rest of the packs. So thank you, Justin H. for that. Daniel, Patera, you have the rest. I don't know. I mean, how much did they, they they sold David Luiz for a ton of money. Are they really going to pay all that again? I don't know. Maybe his value has dropped considerably. All right. So, Daniel, the rest of these are yours. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to uh, open and stack all the packs for you. And then we'll go through all the cards. Good luck. Now, we know the hit is in there because unfortunately, Nicholas and Justin did not get the hit. Now it's just a matter of finding out what the hit is. Oh, I see. So for, for the Premier League, it ends tomorrow. Gotcha. And then, but for France, the deadline is today. I see. Yeah, I'm not sure how that works either. I think I think you can still I think France can still negotiate with the Premier League. I think they're still they're still open. Justin Medrano says would he would be he's a Chelsea supporter, would be thrilled to see David Luiz at Chelsea again. And that hair, right? Sideshow Bob. So what Evan's saying they made a thirty-two million dollar or 32 pound bid, 32 million pound bid for David Luiz. Interesting. Well, hey, listen, maybe we can pull some David Luiz out of our Futera soccer rig, which is coming up next. All right, so these are the Star Wars packs for Daniel P. Good luck, Dan. The hit is in here somewhere. Obviously, everything ships. You'll get everything here. These are refractors, and there are also uh, certain cards that are uh, numbered as well. You'll, you'll notice them kind of right away. Oh, Evan's a Chelsea supporter as well. Um, I support Liverpool. So there'll, there'll be a little bit. There's the hit. Nian Nub. Nice. Mike Quinn, of course. There you go. So that's the hit. Now, there are also like different like parallels of some of the inserts. There's usually one or two per box. Let's see if we can find a, a low numbered card there. Is this something? Maybe not. That's just a regular refractor. Maybe not. Usually I find at least one per box. Maybe I missed it, but we're obviously going to get everything, Justin. Kylo Ren's power. That was a cool moment. When he stopped that blaster shot, I was like, dang. All right. Looks like that's it. The Wrath Towers were terrifying too. And there is your hit, Justin. Thank you very much for grabbing all those spots on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Really appreciate it. Thanks to Nicholas and thanks to Justin as well for giving this one a shot. We have another one box break on the website right now, jazbeeshobbyland.com. May the force be with you.